<laughs> so tell me, okay, I know you have a you, you want to talk to me about stocks, and I I'll and I'll let me preface okay. this. I don't know anything about okay. stocks. So I'm going to <sighs> just prepare yourself. I'm a, a lot. <laughs> it the past couple of days have been it. crazy. Um, and I, it's and let me, here. a disclaimer, I know nothing about the stock market. This is not buy financial. Sell, buy sell. I, it's, you're just not giving advice. I know. Okay. Buy low, yes. sell high. This is the required disclaimer. I know nothing about finance. <laughs> Don't take any of this as financial advice. I can feel our first here lawsuit we go. coming on. <laughs> <laughs> big, big suit coming. Um, so it's crazy because in the past couple of weeks, um, GameStop has gotten a lot of interest why now game now you know gamestop is kind of like the blockbuster of video games at this point right it's a dying yes i didn't think they had stores anymore they do apparently oh there's one in point loma square one in point loma square but the point is it's a failing company because you can get so many games online like just download them now right right to your uh your console or whatever on amazon Um, is killing everybody but yes yes so there's been this viral post on Reddit recently um, mm-hmm. of a guy who had had two years. It was like a post from 2019, and it's he said it, it was like a yo a YOLO basically, mm-hmm. and he had invested like a hundred thousand dollars into GameStop. <laughs> Dang. And at the time, the shares were like five dollars a share, and the comments were like, "You're crazy, like bro, say goodbye to your money, like this, you know, GameStop's going bankrupt." And time has gone on, and the stock has like gained traction and is making these guys money. Like, like he's, he's like, Oh, here's a, my year update. He made like $2 million or something. No, I yeah. thought he made, I thought he made $11 million. No. So what is he up until, now? up until like <laughs> oh. November. Oh, okay. So there was a big, um, spike. I, there was a big spike in, I guess, stock sale, whatever you call it. Yeah. Like the stock price went way up where, where it was now like, it was at $5 a share. It had gone up to like $20 a share or something. And this dude, yeah, was like doubling his money, trip quadrupling his money. And so it became oh, this. Now, this is the power of the internet right here is that it became this thing where all of these Redditors were like backing him. And there's a subreddit called um, Wall Street Bets. And it's, <laughs> and it's, don't ever, if you, if you value your life and your time, don't ever go there. Don't ever it go is there. full You'll of, never leave. it's full of people that are just like psycho. Yeah. And they're like, yeah, yo, I YOLO'd my entire life savings into this, yo. And it oh like drops gosh. and dies. But in this case, <laughs> all of these rogue people are like helping this stock go up. Mm. And so on Monday, wait, let me get this right. On Friday, the price of the stock went from like $30 a share to like $80. There was like a 150%, I'm getting the numbers wrong, but it was like 150% <laughs> increase. It was a huge increase in, yeah. in stock. And it was like rattling the whole thing. Like these random people are driving up the price of the stock just because it's like not um, like in a hedge fund. It's not like um, short traders or anything. It's just random people like buying, buying up the, the price. And from from what I've read, it's like these these brokers will do this where they'll buy the, like they'll borrow stocks and they'll sell them so that when the price drops, like when a company goes bankrupt, they can buy them back and then they've made a profit off of it. Mm. So that's kind of what happened like in 2008, the the housing crisis and everything. Um, And so now it's like, it's flipped where they're, the price of these borrowed stocks is going up and up and up. And eventually they'll have to buy back, you know, it's like it's like billion dollar brokers will eventually like be bankrupt because <gasps> the price of the stock just keeps going up. Oh my god. Today it went up something like 200% increase, like ridiculous yeah. amounts of money. That's great. I love it's that. It's so and it's crazy because like, you know, Wall Street for from what I can tell it's like it's just this big gamble like the the fact that, you yeah. know, gambling the stock like brokerages and and day trading and all of that should probably be illegal, but <laughs> We let it happen because it's all these, you know, multi-billionaires that are doing it. Mm. And now it's flipping and you can kind of tell from what I've seen and watched, like the attitude is changing as far as like people on the news are like, yeah, they can't be doing this. Like, it's just, I don't know. It's been a wild ride. Like I just had to talk about it because (laughs) I've just been watching the number go up all like, I can't stop looking at it. I'm just like, oh my God. Is GameStop doing better? Or or is everyone buying no. the stock and that's what's making it? I think yeah. it's like both. It I think where it started was they got a new CEO who was Amen. the guy that um, established WAG, I think. Or, or oh, yeah, no, yeah, no, no, yeah. no, not WAG, um, Chewy. 
Oh, the like chewy, ordering good. pet supplies yeah. stuff. Oh, okay. So he like took the on for being the CEO. Great biscuits. Yeah, not Wag, but uh, Chewy. Mm-hmm. Really good biscuits. Um, took on GameStop, like was supposed to be revamping the company. And what's more is they announced that they were going to release, um, not release, but they were going to start selling parts for PC gaming computers. Mm. Smart. That's a huge industry. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So that alongside of this like rogue, like come on, you know, we the people attitude of hundred thousand um, they call them retail traders. It's like and, and there's doing... and there's two million people on this subreddit. Like that's if they all invested, you know, a couple thousand dollars, like that's so just this guy started a revolution. Seems to be. <laughs> seems to be. And he's rolling in cash right now. Right? Yeah. His, well, yeah, his the update is, does today. Does he sell it? Does he sell it now? Oh, or and that's and that's kind it? of it's kind of this meme. That's what's weird about the whole thing is it's kind of a meme. Like people it's are like posting social media meets Wall Street. Yes, yeah, it's, <laughs> it's like, like they've game. Like they they keep saying they've gamified like trading, and everyone keeps posting the little like rocket ship emoji like and like just spamming the, the subreddit like we're going hold to the moon everybody we're going to the moon <laughs> like like don't don't let go they keep posting like video clips of like brave heart like come on man like <laughs> oh it's this gosh. whole weird community that is actually like making money in making money off of it this dude posted today his update from today's crazy like shoot up of the the price He's like at twenty three million dollars. Oh, he's got twenty three million dollars in out. in two Cash years out. doing nothing, like sitting on it, just so holding he, it. So he, he just he doesn't have that money. He'd have to sell all. He'd have to sell to all the it. shares because the, and that's the the that's dicey right. thing about so if stocks. That, if that specific guy sells mm-hmm. all of his shares, mm-hmm. will that's will GameStop be like? Yeah, have like so that Dunzo? That's kind of the How thing. How much of an impact does is, he have? Yeah. That, well, I don't know yeah, one specific really? person because really he's only got you know so many who shares. Pays him that? But that's GameStop? so that's what's crazy. That's why you watch it because when it drops, it means somebody cashed out. Yeah. When the price of the the stock so drops, that guy could single handedly ruin. It, GameStop, it would bro. drop easy a couple like probably like twenty points, and then people would be like, "Oh, it's yeah, dropping," and that makes other selling. people sell, <sighs> and then it just keeps going down, 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 down. So that guy could kill GameStop. And like I said, I know <laughs> what kind of power. I'm Just only getting little. Handedly. I'm only getting little bits of it. But from what I can tell, this is like people do this when companies are like heading out, going bankrupt. They will legitimately like bury them in the ground to make. You know, like like brokerage companies will like bury them by just buying the buying the stocks or no, not buying them, borrowing them from the. Something like that. I don't know. They'll borrow them, <laughs> sell them at a high price, mm-hmm. and then re- like buy them at a low price. All and right. so as the stock goes down, oh, sell high. Yeah, exactly. Mm. It's a motto. We know it's that. crazy. We know. It's just the the craziest part for me is like I said, just like that that many people can get together and like have that kind of impact yeah. in a weird way that's making like a whole different culture. Like it's like the internet. I don't want to say internet troll culture, but it's just yeah. like crazy people on the internet that got together and have these ideas and it's them versus like old Wall Street. Like mm-hmm. and they're, they're flipping the script. That's what I love. Absolutely. Yeah. That, where these big hedge funds are going to have to pay out and, and be like down billions legal. of dollars. <laughs> What's that? We'll probably end up just being illegal. Like, you wouldn't guys that be interesting? I would illegal. not after this whole thing because that's how it happens, right? Like, I don't know. Yeah, but that's I how we figure like out what laws are, right? Media. Somebody right. does something really. Somebody does like, something. Wait, make a lot of that. Make, make sure they don't do that yeah. again. Hey, that's <laughs> weird. We should all. Hey, guys, let's all stop trading now. <laughs> now it's wrong. Close down Wall Street, for right? Us. Just- when somebody else is making money off of it, it's like, no, that's not gonna work. 